have to say, the more I learn about the ocean, the more I realize is what we see happening on land is the tip of the iceberg compared to what's happening in our planet. About 70% of our, of our planet is ocean. Not only is over 70% of our planet ocean, over 90% of the extra heat that is being trapped inside the climate system by human emissions of heat trapping gases, over 90% of that heat is going into the ocean. And in the ocean, species can move much faster because they don't have to worry about habitat fragmentation and going through cities and things like that. So in the ocean, species are moving much faster and plankton, phytoplankton and zooplankton are some of the fastest moving species that we see. And when I say moving, I mean the center of their distributions are moving towards the poles because they're searching for cooler water. Some of them are moving by tens, even hundreds of kilometers per decade, which is, we don't see anything like that on land. So there are massive changes happening in the ocean. A lot of the changes are happening due to warming. We hear a fair amount about ocean acidification because the ocean, of course, is also taking up a good proportion of the carbon dioxide we put in the atmosphere. So the ocean's becoming more acidic, but it's also becoming a lot warmer. And so a lot of, um, it's 90% um, uh, right now. I mean, the amount, I think it's about 20 times more right, right now that's going into the ocean than any other part of the Earth system, Chris. Um, so uh, even though the ocean is becoming more acidic, the coral problems that we see with coral die-offs, those are primarily happening due to warmer ocean exacerbated by acidification and pollution. So warming oceans are one of the biggest problems.